Hi there, everybody, and welcome to the Lower Method Road Fields here just off the campus of North Carolina State University in a lovely Raleigh, North Carolina. It's a cool, calm, and crisp evening. Overall, beautiful weather for lacrosse. Hi there, everybody. I'm Drew Blevins, joined by Chris Lehman for what promises to be a barn burner of a lacrosse match between the North Carolina State Wolfpack and the State University of New York at Buffalo Bisons. Chris, ball is down. The officials continue to set, and away we go. Sit back, relax, and enjoy this one from Raleigh. Quickly ahead is Jack Sarley. He picks it up. NC State's going to go on the attack first. And they'll look to pass around the perimeter. So good at doing that. That's how they're going to manufacture a majority of their offense. Leffler again. This time he sets it back up at the point. Good movement of the ball here by the Buffalo Bisons. NC State's defense has been solid as well, though. They haven't put anything on to Brady Edwards. A couple of block shots for the Wolfpack. Back behind the net, good movement here. Up for Thomas Froelich who scores! Froelich with an absolute rip from about 20 feet out. It's the Buffalo Bisons who draw first blood. Chris. Buffalo in the white lids. Taking here, good slicing action by Pete Flood as he sends that one back out, Matt Bozek. Over for Flood once again. Spin move, he's being hassled. Quick shot, a little bouncer off of Brady Edwards. Back even now. Hack and whack time, body check laid. Somehow, magically, Ryan McCart gets through with possession. He's whacked from behind. State picking up the ground ball now. A little bouncer, nope, Buffalo's got it. State continues to possess. This will be sent right back out by Nick Davis. He's got Deaver going in front. Could be a chance for NC State. Shot, they scored! Leffler all the way back down. Sam Solano's been the facilitator. He's going to get it here. Solano's been one of those guys that has consistently been here for this Bison team. He's going to get it again. Bison's content to work back behind, trying to draw NC State's defenders out. Good stop from Edwards, turn back over. Buffalo in front! Did it go in? Yes, it did. That just, will count as the official just gave the signal. It looked like that may have deflected off of Brady Edwards as I think he got a piece of it, but it beats him low through the wickets, and Buffalo retakes the lead. That's just, and it looks like... We'll turn the camera back over here so you can see what's going on. It looks like a lower body injury. That much is for certain. And it looks like it'll be number 18, Jack Sarley. State will hold possession here as they held possession before the whistle was blown for the injury timeout, so that will resume. Back up top, Christopher Schultz. Trying to do it with his feet. Schultz winds, fires! I don't think Macius ever saw it, but it's not going to matter. State will maintain possession here. Nope. It's on the ground again. State's got it. Poor turnover. Cole Deaver on the fast break sends it across. State ties the game. Oh, what a finish. Another one goes in for the Wolfpack. And that one is going to be number 23, Miller Barber, the sophomore midfielder from Charlotte, who puts that one home. That's spectacular, Chris. On the fast break quickly. No, I take that back. Misread the number. It's going to be Jesse Melton instead for his second of the game. Uh, Got to be impressed there with Melton as he's using his speed to get back behind the defense. Deaver once again finds him with a solid pass to knock this thing's up deuces apiece. Ground ball off of the face-off, overhand whack, Mastriani takes it, solid pass up for Deaver, here comes the Wolfpack again. Hound dogged by number 14, McCart. In front, again, a bounce shot misses. Ott, over for Froelich once again, for Frankie Leffler. In front, Ott, slicing and dicing, sent it over the bar. Well, it looks like that due to the weather, we are going to have to cease the coverage here. And it is unfortunate we did have a barn burner going. And you can certainly stay up to date on our Twitter page as we will have the result as soon as it is relayed to us. Unfortunately, we regret to inform you we'll have to end the broadcast. Signing off for the rest of our crew, Chris Lehman included. I'm Drew Blevins. We hope you've enjoyed what we've been able to bring you so far, but we will have to sign off early. Thanks for watching.